in your apex application sometimes you might wish to generate html yourself manually until now you can do this with the pl sql dynamic content region this lacks some functionality for example you cannot refresh the region apex 222 introduces a brand new dynamic content region this region is similar to the pl sql dynamic content region but with some key differences the dynamic content region source must return the HTML value as a varchar or C log. The content is not generated via the HTTP package. The dynamic content region is refreshable and supports lazy loading. The region source can be written in PL SQL or JavaScript MLE if you are using database 21C or above. Now let us take a quick look at an example of the new dynamic content region introduced in Apex 22.2. I already have an application with a page that has a dynamic content region created in. Now let us look at the source of the region. This actually reads from the EMP table and outputs some HTML. It also displays the current time. Now, the region source must return the HTML value as a varchar or a C log. Now, let us run the page. It displays the employee details and you see a refresh button here. Let's click this. This shows that the time is updated, which means the region is refreshed. So, the dynamic content region is refreshable either via the dynamic action or the JavaScript API. So the new dynamic content region introduced in Apex 22.2 is refreshable. It supports lazy loading. The content is not generated via the HTTP package. The region source can be written in PL SQL or if you are using database 21C and above, you can use JavaScript MLE.